We never want to list your trust as a manager of anything, ever, ever, ever. You can manage, a corporation can manage, another LLC or limited partnership can manage, but we never want to list the trust as a manager. That, that, that's not necessarily a bad thing, but we don't want the trust to do anything. We, the, the trust can't function. You, as the trustee, you could, you could function. Uh, but generally, we don't want that to manage, not a revocable living trust. I wouldn't have it, I would not, I, I, I would never have a revocable living trust manage anything. Okay, and then her last question is, uh, if I list myself on the policy as well, does that pierce the corporate veil since my LLC should remain separate from myself to avoid the alter ego you yeah, I've never listed myself as an additionally insured. I've listed my IRA. Okay, a house comes in, and I've listed the property, and I've listed the the LLC as an additionally insured. I've listed the um, the IRA that owns the property as an additionally insured. But me as an owner, I, I no, I keep my name off. I, I don't list myself as an additionally insured. Um, maybe if I were the manager of the property, maybe the property management company, if I'm personally managing that property, perhaps, but I would prefer that you have a property management company, even if you own the property management company, if that makes sense. Could you list yourself as an additionally insured? Yeah, I suppose you could. But it, remember that they're insuring the property they're not insuring you. This is not a personal liability insurance policy that you're getting. You're getting an insurance policy, a liability policy on the house. Talk to your agent and they should be able to clarify this and give and, 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 th and then provide exactly what they want. But tell them what you're doing. But I, I think it's rare that we would list an, a person as an additionally insured.